Hey guys, I'm back. I just finished up um, one uh, poor uh, swipe with those beautiful colors. And these are the leftovers. So I grabbed a little uh, 10 by 10. And uh, I'm just gonna see what I can do out of that. So I may gonna do, hey, I can do one of those blow thingies. I have to practice those anyway. So since I have all of these colors here, just see. Let's see. Here we go. Blow thingies. <laughs> you guys probably think I'm crazy. Here we go. Put that one on top of there. All right. All right. All right. Now I don't have anything really prepared, Edmund. Uh, tools but I have them handy in the back. So here we go. Some orange and some greens. I don't have golds in here today. Which I don't think I need because of the yellow. Okay. Got some orange on here. So I'm going with the same color theme as I did before. Um, this is an, an 8 by 8 canvas. I think I mentioned that before. So that's about 20.3 by 20.3 centimeters for everyone else outside the U.S. And, um, and I think I'm going to do the one with the straw. Not a Dutch pour because I'm not going to use my um, I'm not going to use my blow dryer. I use a straw. Here we go. Okay, let's layer again. I need plenty of color in here, so. Okay. And then I have this, the turquoise. And then I had the yellow, let me see. I just wanna use up all the colors. And I love these colors. They came out really cute in that little springy Easter garden one. Here we go. So I had then yellow and then I'm gonna do emerald green. <clears throat> so hopefully this will be a little shorter video. The other way that I just did was about 30 something minutes. And uh, so green, orange. And so it's double layers. And then I have the orange, and then I have the light blue, the morning blue. So I like these little spoons. That looks like great. I also like the fact that we can just clean these up very easily. So I have the blue and then I guess we got a little red again. Oh, see, I have another glitter color here that I had left over. That was my leftovers from, from yesterday. So probably not gonna make much of a difference. So, so I'm not really gonna go for a flower because I know I suck at this, but I will just See what happens. And those are usually the best pictures. Maybe because we just have to come to peace with our lack of ability to do these things um, the way the pros do it, huh? I know. And I'm just blobbling around right now, so. So if I need a little bit more something to smear on the sides. I got a little bit here, so I'm gonna do a little bit of the yellow left, a little drop over here. I got them pretty much emptied out, so. Mm. 
Oh, baby spatula. I know I have one somewhere. That has always been working really good. A little green. A little drop here. It's a lot of a lot of color, but a lot more green left over. It's fine. And we have the orange. Oops. Let me dip the orange in the green. There we go. There we go. All right. And then orange and then light blue, which I already used up, right? Yeah, I don't think there's much left here. Little dip. All right. Just a little bit. And then what was that? Light blue. Oh, and then I had that. So we did three. So we did three layers, okay? Now this is gonna get messy, so I have to be careful. I'm gonna move my other picture that I just did a little bit further away and out of the way. And hopefully I'm not gonna get this all over. I did last time and I was a little bummed. Anyway, so um, where do I have my straws? I mean, I have bucketfuls of straws. So let's see. Oh. You know, that what happens when you reorganize your space and then you can't find anything because it's all in these new places. Okay, here are my straws. I'm gonna put these right here. Oh, okay. Now I'm gonna do some white around it. So, lots of white. Maybe I should have had a little bit of um, Um, separation white here? I don't know. Oh well, too late now, isn't it? There we go. If that's what you kind of need. Yeah, feel free to fast forward to that part until I get my straws out. Don't you sometimes wish you could fast forward through life? Or rewind, rewind. Some of the stuff would be really cool to rewind. All right, here we go. Okay, and what I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna start blowing that way. Here we go. And it's gonna go that way, and I'm afraid of that, so this is not far away from me. Okay, I'm gonna put this, and hopefully the transfer is not going to so this is the one i just did before and so we're using the leftover colors from that and here we go here we go that was out of the way hopefully i'm not gonna lean myself into it i've done this before okay i got a couple straws just in case all right let's do this can you see? Okay. All right. Here we go. Okay. Three colors. I'm gonna let just leave that in there. Here we go. Ooh, lots of red in there. Yep, it's like all the way over there. Yep, all good. There we go. All right, so this is my little burst, my flower burst. There's a little bit of white in here, but you know, I'm, I'm learning now not to temper around too much. Break it up a little bit. This is pretty. Here we go. 
It's a pretty leftover design. Soften up the white a little bit. Got some orange here, some blues, turquoises. So that's actually very pretty. Very pretty. So let me see. These are all. Yeah, that's just one of those things you are not going to have. This is why we need so much white, don't we? But I think it came out pretty. There we go. Just put a little bit more paint on there. Maybe something is going to run over eventually. Oops. Be careful with um. Oh, kitty, here you go again. You make to make an appearance every time I close that door, huh? All right. So I got a little bit of that feather through here. Maybe I can give a little bit direction. Oh, let's see what's under there. Here we go. That makes sense. Now the white already kind of disappeared. So... a little bit of, you know. There we go. All right, it's starting to run again. I, I, I need to leave a little bit of white background there. Otherwise, it's gonna... So I guess I do go a little bit for a flower, flower thing. All right, I admit it. Okay. All right. Filling in the gaps here. Eventually, I think I'm gonna pre-fill myself some um, some of these bottles with those beautiful colors here, individually, so I can kind of use these for filling in the gaps. Okay, there we go. All right, guys, I'm just gonna finish this up. All right, I don't think you guys wanna watch this. Um, and, uh, let me get the info. I'm probably just going to zoom in when I'm editing, but here, he has a quick up and a down. Yeah, just a quick one. I don't want to move it around too much. All right. Didn't really do the flowery thing. That's the way I kind of said I'm not going to do it, but ah oh well. Anyway, well, guys, I hope you had fun watching that little experiment. Uh, just leftover colors. So every time you have some project going on, have a smaller cameras ready and maybe do something else creative on the whim. It's a great way to practice some techniques, uh, which I need to definitely practice on because um, I'm not quite getting it right. But anyway, so I hope you had fun watching me. Have fun with colors and I'll see you again. Bye.